<laughs> Hello, welcome. Uh, my name is Guillermo, MBK Game Farms. Um, I, 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 I have a channel here on YouTube that, that a lot of people follow, especially uh, Hispanic speaking audience. But I have several followers that have asked me to make a video in English uh, in regards to training and conditioning of the game board, right? Now, this, this are, all these videos are for uh, educational purposes. There is no intent to harm in any birds. Uh, this is basically just to bring awareness to people about, about the Hispanic culture of uh, raising uh, game birds, right? So, uh, I did this for 17 years, by the way. Uh, I'm a, my name is Guillermo. I'm, I'm a veteran. United States Marine Corps. Uh, I have a bachelor's degree uh, in Spanish, and and um, and I love I love this culture. This is part of my heritage, part of my background, and so every time I have a chance to speak about it, I do. I, I want to bring a, awareness to people of how uh, little by little this industry is, is uh, losing the fight against uh, against laws that are being passed against it, and so uh, to try to to bring awareness to to uh, people i decided to start making educational videos on youtube so that they can uh, they, so that we can stop some of these laws that they're passing against the game board uh, industry um I, I need to let everybody know that that um, the game bird industry it's, it's a multi-million dollar industry it creates a lot of revenue um, makes money go around there's a lot of employment uh that this industry provides also uh, um a lot of, uh, of, of uh, cash that generates that uh, you know helps with the infrastructure of our cities and, and towns so you know I, I just want to make people aware of this that, that when they when they pass laws against this industry they're they're hurting everybody right well without further ado I'm gonna teach you a um, couple of exercises these are table exercises this is uh, to work the bird uh, uh, their leg muscles and their wings and and um there's two types of exercises there's anaerobic exercise which deals with strength and there's aerobic exercise which which deal with endurance you know so what what you're going to be learning right now it's uh, it's it's two exercises it's how to work the bird on the table how to work him out on the table and you're going to be learning how to work his leg muscles and 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 also how to how to work his wings so it, it, I did this for 17 years, like I was saying, and, and I made a living of it. I put, I pay my school through, you know, I pay my schooling through this. And so, so I like to think that I know quite a little bit about game birds when it comes to conditioning. Um, so without further ado, let me explain to you what I'm going to do. I'm going to walk this bird back and forth. Now, I do this uh, in repetitions. So we're going to do... Uh, three repetitions and and that's going to be uh, one set and, and you only do one set of each so so um this is this is the first repetition what i'm going to do is i'm going to put a little bit of, of back pressure and i'm going to make him walk forward but i'm not going to press down on him i don't want to do that what i want to do is i want to push him forward to create resistance he's going to be trying to stop from going forward and and i'm going to be pushing him but i'm going to do this gently because um uh, these birds have to be treated gently. They cannot be treated uh, harsh. They're very, very fragile animals, very fragile creatures, and so you gotta take really good care of them. So the way you do this, you place your hand on the back like this, and you walk them forward. And, and if you pay attention and you listen, you can hear where he's trying to stop. You hear that? You put your hand in front. If you put your hand in front, that creates resistance. See that? And this I would do 50 times, counting one this way, two this way, three this way, four this way, until I reach 50. So it'll look like this at normal speed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and so on and so forth until I reach 50. That's what I'm doing. I'm training this part of his muscles right here that part right there that's what i'm working on now next exercise is the wing exercise gonna flap his wings and this is considered consider an uh, aerobic exercise um 
The secret to doing this properly is this. <laughs> you see his, you see the tip of his wing here? You see that part right there? Well, imagine if you will, a line. Draw a line across here. And what you wanna do is when you, when you throw him upwards to fly him, you want his legs to reach this altitude right here. So in other words, when I fly him, I want his legs, both of his legs right here, this part, this part of his feet, I want him to end up right here. Now, there's two, there's several ways of doing this. The proper way, the way I was taught by a Puerto Rican uh, friend of mine, you hold him by the, show, by the wings like this, and I'm gonna call them shoulders, but they're not. You hold him from here, and you're gonna fly him upwards. Now, the movement itself is like this. Okay, so, see that? Let's do it again. That's two, three, and I would do this 20 times. When I get to 20, I'm gonna do it 10 more times, but this time when I do it, as soon as he lands, I'm gonna put pressure on his back. I'm gonna try to pull him, push him downwards gently. What this is gonna do is, as soon as he feels he's going downwards, he's gonna go like this. He's gonna make resistance with his legs not gonna want to go down that's where you stop you don't want to push him down you just want him to make resistance out so that it looked like this see that again see that as soon as he makes resistance you let go and that and you will do that 10 more times so the total will be 30 flies but you're gonna do 20 and then you're gonna do 10 that way and you're gonna do that three times and that completes the set now this is a complete exercise on the table you do it three times, you know, 50 times, you walk him 50 times, and you fly him 30 times, and you walk him 50 times, and you fly him 30 times, and then you do it for one more time. There's one set, that's all you need to do. Now, uh, there's a lot of Hispanic people that follow my channel, and um, if you ever wanna go in there and look at the reviews that I've gotten, there are all positive reviews. This is a very, very competitive method of working your rooster on the table. It works. If you want to learn more, subscribe to my channel. I will be doing more videos in English. I will teach you. Uh, I'm gonna be making some videos about uh, about the feet, how I feed my roosters, uh, also about vitamins, and 